Hello everybody, welcome to the engineering section where we explore painting and other ways to improve your Armada gameplay experience. My name is Courtney and today I'll show you how I paint Rebel Fighters. The first two steps are the same for all fighters. First base coat the fighters in a cream, I've used Rakar Flesh from the Games Workshop range. Make sure you cover the whole fighter including the bottom of the fighter. The second step is to wash the fighters with a black wash. I've used Games Workshop's Null Oil. Make sure you cover the whole fighter during this state. Don't put the wash on too heavy. If you do put it on too heavy, just wash out your brush and remove excess wash from the model. Once these two steps are complete on all of your models, we can move on to painting individual fighters. I'm going to start with X-Wings. Apply a red stripe down each side of the X-Wing. It doesn't have to be red, it can be any colour. I've used red for demonstration purposes. Very carefully apply a black spot to where the cockpit is. Then in a colour of your choosing apply a spot to where the R2 unit is. The next step is to apply metal colour to the engines and the wing tips. Very carefully apply them to the engines not going all of the way up, but just the back half of them. Then apply it to the wing tips as well. The last step is to carefully place a blue dot on each of the engine exhausts. And there we have it, a completed X-Wing. Now on to A-Wings. Very carefully apply a colour starting from the inside of the two wing tips all of the way down to the front of the A-Wing model. If you get bits on the cockpit now, don't worry about it, you'll be able to fix it later. The next step is the cockpit. You apply black to the front section of the cockpit and there's a little bit just behind it. Make sure you avoid getting black on the raised bit between the two sections of the cockpit. Apply a metal color to the wingtips where the weapons are.
Finally, apply blue to where the exhausts are. There we have it, a completed A-Wing. Now on to Y-Wings. Apply yellow to the front of the Y-Wings cockpit on the upper side. Apply blue to the engine exhausts. There we have it, a completed Y-Wing. Now finally on to B-Wings. Apply blue to the main section of the B-Wing. Apply blue to the lower cannon and also to the other two wings just inside where the cannon is. Apply red dots on all of the wings on both sides of the wings just above where the blue is. Apply blue to the engine exhaust. And there we have it, a completed B-Wing. You can use nearly any colour you have in place of the colours I've used. Here are three examples of A-Wings. Thanks for watching the engineering section, catch you next time.